Wow, nice sound. What mouthpiece do you use? Well, it's a mouthpiece made specially for me by Sayos. Well, uh, how does it work? Well, you go on their website and you answer some questions on whether you want your mouthpiece to be powerful or maybe not so much. Maybe you want it dark, you want it bright, anything you can have. And you can choose the color as well? Yeah, you can choose anything about the external appearance of the mouthpiece. You can choose the color, you can have it in many, many colors, very flashy one like pink, like yellow, like orange. You can also choose maybe if you want some engraving, you can have your name on your mouthpiece. That's quite funny, right? But I see you two are interested in those mouthpieces. So maybe we should come and see Pauline. Hi, I heard that you wanted to discover how we create our custom mouthpieces. Let's have a look with Maxim. First, with the results of our online questionnaire, we create a 3D model of the mouthpiece on Katia. This is done thanks to thousands of feedbacks that we collected during test sessions with musicians. Each mouthpiece is unique and according to the type of sounds the musician want, we change the chamber size, the baffle kind, the tip opening and a lot of other geometrical parameters. Then, after the simulation step, this 3D model is what we send to the 3D printer. And the next step is to check the aero acoustics, that is the way the air is flowing through the mouthpiece. As you can see on the simulation, there are several key characteristics that define the final sound, such as air turbulences, air pressures, and also the velocity. Correct, Pierre? Yes, definitely, Cédric. Uh, the animation of the velocity field inside the mouthpiece is probably the more interesting information here. That really shows you how the flux is deviated from one di direction to the other. That's what will produce a particular sound. Also, you can check that we have a small bumper at the top of the baffle here, and you can see some recirculation around it. That one will probably have a strong tone. Isn't that what you are looking for, Pauline? Yes, sure. So now, let's see what happens live with that mouthpiece. <laughs>